When was it, if you can remember? <laughs> uh, we met actually through a friend who is unable to come today because he actually left the country. Uh, we met at a meeting with international friends. And from there we started talking and then slowly it turned into love. And now we are getting married. It led to, yeah, we got married <laughs> today. <laughs> Okay, uh, a warm round of applause please. Anasema alikutana naye. <laughs> Anasema alikutana na Mima katika kupitia rafiki yake. Walikuwa kwenye international meetings, meetings za kimataifa, wakabahatika kukutana and from that point slowly they wakaenda ku follow into love. Na when was that? 2016. 2016. Yes. So around five years back. Yes, November. Okay. 29. Yes. <laughs> yeah? 29 November. 29. So 20 uh, 2009. That's when you met. Tw uh, we met 2020, 20, around 20 or 19. Ah, then uh, we started dating on 29. We started going out on 29, mm. and our dating started, I think, after mom, one month of that. Okay. So, what's very special, what's very interesting part of Mima to you? <coughs> She's very honest. Uh, since the day I met her until today, she has been very honest with me, and uh, I trust her with everything. That, that's the most important thing I can, I think you need in a partner. Sure. Jemani, yeah. nimemuuliza kwamba anapendelea nini zaidi kwa Mima. Anasema moja ya sifa kubwa ya Mima, Mima ni muaminifu sana. Mima ni muaminifu ni mtu mkweli na hiyo ndiyo kitu pekea mbacho mpenzi wako, patina wako wa maisha naweza kakuzawadia. Asanteni ungeleni sana wazazi kwa kazi kubwa ya malezi mlio ifanya. Kike maonekana kwa kijana wetu chun. Okay. Okay. So maybe we can we can hear from Mima as well. <laughs> so Mima, we want to if hear from you, <laughs> Mrs. Ochun. If she can remember. Okay. If if she can remember. <laughs> I know women are good on, in on keeping memories. Yeah. They are very good in keeping <laughs> memories. Okay, Mima. How are you, Mima? I'm fine. You're fine. How do you feel tonight? Very happy. Very happy. And I'm so excited for everything you are preparing here tonight. Na okay, anasema kwamba anajisikia furaha sana. Tulikutana upanga nyuma ya kituo cha police cha surrender, surrender bridge. Yes, tulikuwa na barbecue party na marafiki wengine ambao mimi wengine walikuwa ni mabosi zangu na watu wa mabosi zangu. Okay, so at first they met at barbecue part, eh? They are saying at first they met at barbecue part near Upanga. Uh, Ochun was part of the invitees. Okay, so what then, what next, what happened? And then out of all the invited guests, then you happened to see Ochun only. <laughs> Some of them, they are still here. Some of but them are still here. <laughs> they were part of the barbecue part. Please, <laughs> let's see your hands. Okay. Yes. So, I think the story starts when friend of Bashal at the birthday party. Actually, that night nothing happened, and we had just party and leave, and everybody enjoy that company. I will speak so I saw also Tanzanian can understand. Yeah, yeah, sure. Um, usiku kutana, kuliko nisiku kwangu wakaida tu nilienda kwa jili ya kula nyama kwa sababu kwa kuna nyama choma. Na nilikutana na malafiki wengi, tukua tume enjoy ile kampan. Na lafiki yetu pare, anaitua Basha, alikuwa na lafiki yake, ana birthday. Wakasema wata create a group, watu wate tutue numbers wa sim pare, kwa jiri ya kuenda kusherekia ile birthday. And... Asubu yake, ndo nilipo receive message kutoka kwa ocho. Na alichikuwa na bangu kwenye group. Wow. 
So um, what she's trying to say is that during the barbecue party, there was uh, some uh, a guy who was having a birthday on the same date. So what they agreed uh, during the party is that they create a WhatsApp group and everyone uh, at that party has to list their numbers so that an admin can easily add them into WhatsApp group. And then right after, in the morning, she found a text from Ochun. Ochun picked her number from the group. Okay. So how, how uh, out of all the invitees, I know maybe you were around 20, so how did Ochun know that this is the number of Mima? This is Mima's number. I think he, he snaked all the night with their eyes on me. Sababu message yaki ilianza asubu. You add me on Facebook, and I say no. <laughs> okay. You can speak Swahili, then I'll translate. Aya. Ali niambia, message yaki alikuwa nasema, abari asubu, umeniadi Facebook. David likata nikaambia sija kuad. Na baadaye kwa sababu napenda kulala, nilikuwa nimelala na message yake iliingia asubuhi sana kama saa 12. Kwao nilikuwa namjibu kwa asila. Nilipoamka mida saa 4 nikasema I think nimemjibu huyu mtu kiukali sana. Naweza nika start to apologize. Nikaambia so nikamwambia samani huyo mtu unayenifananisha naye sio mimi na hata ukiangalia atufanani. Arandia sawa, amna shida, nilijua ni wewe umeniadi kwenye ukulasa wa Facebook. Nikambia na mimi samani, nimekujibu vile nilikuwa bado nimelala. Na meseji ili nishtua. And, tukaulizana, unazawadi ya best day. <laughs> <laughs> so, you arranged, mliplani mli siku nyingine kuja kufanya yo best day. Yes, kwa sababu group ilikuwa ni kwa ajili ya birthday ya birthday ambayo inakuja the coming yes, birthday. Yes, the coming mm. birthday. Kwa hiyo akaniambia una zawadi ya birthday nikamwambia sina. Unafikiria nini? Nikamwambia bado sijajua kwa sababu hata hao marafiki walikuwa ni mara ya kwanza kwa sisi wote kukutana. Akaniambia labda tunaweza kutafuta kitu kwa pamoja. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. Okay, endelea vima. <laughs> Changing the story. <laughs> She's, she was the one who told me, eh. let's go look for a gift together. Eh. So that's when we actually first met after that party. Okay. And we went to check for gifts together because mm. she wanted to check for gifts. Mm. And then the conversation started. And it started and yes. then it happened up today. Yes. Okay. Santa Sana. Okay. Mima. <laughs> <laughs> you guys look very friendly. You live very friendly. Uh, Asante Sana. So that's the, a brief of the love story, how it started. And today we are celebrating the love as they are now married uh, together. We wish you the very best. So maybe please, may you please come with your glasses here. May you please come with your glasses. We have to celebrate and toast for you guys.